Paradoxically, we need strength the most when we feel at our weakest. It's when our strength seems to have deserted us that we find ourselves in greatest need of it. <laughs> Don't you just hate that? Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond, and welcome again to Fresh. When things are going along well, we just don't feel that we need more strength than we already have. Why would we? But that's where we're lulled into a false sense of security, because when we do run head on into challenging times, that self-confidence that we had just a moment ago evaporates in an instant. At which point we have to make a choice. Either we turn to God to get us through, or we rely on human strength. And as we're about to see, making the right choice at that point is absolutely crucial. The Lord God, the Holy One of Israel says, if you come back to me, you'll be saved. Only by remaining calm and trusting in me can you be strong. But you don't want to do that. You say, no, no, we'll need fast horses for battle. That's true. You will need fast horses, but only to run away because your enemy will be faster than your horses. One enemy soldier will make threats and a thousand of your men will run away. And when five of them make threats, all of you will run away. The only thing that will be left of your army will be a flagpole on a hill. The contrast between the outcomes of those different choices, either relying on God or on human strength, couldn't be more stark. There's only one way to remain strong. Go to God, be calm, and trust in Him. Because that's His Word, fresh for you today. Powerful stuff. And if you'd like to go a bit deeper, then stop by and explore ChristianityWorks.com where you'll find a wealth of messages on all sorts of different subjects straight out of God's Word and conveniently arranged so that you can find exactly what you need for today. Again, that's all at ChristianityWorks.com.